Hey, what's up guys? Sean back with another video, and this one is from a channel called Body Cam Reality News. I watch a ton of police cams. I'm not sure why. As a young degenerate myself, I pretty much just did everything but be a cop, but this is as close as I get. This, or when I get a haircut, I think makes me look like a cop, and I tell my girl she has to call me Deputy Dangle for like a week or two, but that usually passes. And then we get to something like this. But this one, Sumo Lady Challenges Entire Department. So I'm guessing this is a big chick. So let's see what she's got going on and what the hell she did here. Because it's probably pretty damn funny. On Tuesday night, March 14th, just after midnight, officers were called over concerns for a driver who was blocking the entrance to an apartment complex. Oh, man. No. I'm officer stick with Thicker's like TV. <laughs> Off bat, chick, like, when you just laugh, like, she just looks dazed. She looks shocked that they came up to her. And I think they got a pretty good radar to tell if somebody's effed up. And I would immediately think this chick's effed up anyway. Um, someone called in. Um, they were complaining about your music being kind of loud from your car. Really? Do you live over here? Yeah. Okay. Music. Okay. Why are you, uh... uh because you're kind of parked in the middle of the entrance. So what where, now? Where were you coming from? I'm coming from nowhere. I'm just I'm sitting here. Okay. Oh, here's that. Oh, yeah. Um, Your ass better call back up. She's not a little lady. I often wondered, like, if I were to get in trouble and I was just to go dead weight on them, what the hell were they going to do? They'd have to call the damn fire department with a ladder or something, a wench. I don't know how they would deal with that. Because 605 pounds of dead weight's a different kind of beast. They can't deal with that. No shot. Um, Where were you, uh, were you parked somewhere and then you decided to drive right here? Some, um, you know what I mean? Because you're not really in a parking spot right now. No, and I feel like... Oh, God. So can you do me a favor and step out of the car? I'm just going to run you through some... No, uh, I don't want to step out. You don't want to step out of the car? Okay, well, at this point, I'm not asking you to step out. So I, I need you to step out of the car. In a, a better place from here? I'm, no, you can't. You can't drive it away right now. I'm gonna need you to step out of the car, okay? Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm not asking you. So I'm gonna need you to step out of the car, okay? Lady, like, get your drunk ass out of the car. You're caught at this point. Like when you're caught, you're caught. There's no point in even fighting it right here. But if you had a breath mint or something, you know, you might want to pop that sucker in because they're probably smelling all kinds of alcohol on this chick. And if you're like a kid doing something that stupid, like I get it, everyone makes mistakes, but you're a grown ass woman. Like you're putting all kinds of people's lives at risk. So I just, I don't appreciate drunk drivers at all. I think they're the dumbest people on earth because it's a big, big risk, right? Okay, I've already told you, I'm not, I'm not asking you. I'm telling you to do it. And if you don't do it, we're gonna have to take you out ourselves, and I don't want to have hey, to do we that. Don't step out. Okay. Nope. So are you gonna make me? Take you out myself. I need you to step out of the car, Hannah. Okay. Okay, Hannah. I've already told you. If what, you don't, why am I stepping out? So just running through these tests, it helps me make a better decision. Can I just back the car back no, up I, in the I, parking I, no, spot? No, I, I can't let you do that. Okay, we'll take care yeah, of the no, I... we'll take care of the car. Because you're you're drunk, you can't let you drive this car right now. We'll take care of the vehicle. Yeah, right. Good luck with Hannah's hammered ass. You ain't got a shot at getting that lady out of that car, buddy. She's wedged in there like something I've seen on other websites. You are not standing a chance. He don't sound like he got enough bass in his voice to pick her up. Once we get done. So, Hannah, your two options are either you step out of the car okay. voluntarily. Stop with the lights. No. Either you're going to step out voluntarily or we're going to pull you out of the vehicle. Make it easier and just step out of the vehicle. So for what us do right I do now. after I step out, then what? Well, you don't have a choice. It's either stepping out of the car or we're going to drag you out of the car. No, let's no, let no, 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 no. We're done with that. It's either you step out of the car I know. or we're going to drag annoying. you out of the car. It's Those annoying, are your two options. I know that's my options now. Okay, I which, don't have options. which option are you going to take? Priority or what do you think you do when you get out of the car? They check to see how drunk you are. You're not going to step out of here and like do the freaking crip walk or something. Like they're not asking you to do a dance for them. Just get your ass out, stand on one leg, do what you got to do, right? Okay, right so let me just park no, it. And no, just let no, me... you're not going to park it. You don't have that choice. It's either step out of the so car now. So what do I do? Okay, you're not going to step out of the car for us? I don't know what to do. Step I don't out know. of the car. I... Stop. This last chance. Either step out of Taser. the car or we're going to pull you out. 
No. You're not going to step out? Okay. Oh, wait, stop. No, you're done. Two. You are no, under arrest right now. Out. Get out of the car. Hannah. Hannah. Mm -hmm. Oh, I am so strong. Okay, get out of the car. <laughs> Oh, y'all are oh, I... Ain't no shot you're getting them thick thighs around that steering wheel, buddy. I could have wedged in that sucker like a champ back in the day, too. I probably still can, honestly. Yeah, I think I still could. I work hard. I work hard. Get out of the car, Hannah. Now. Hannah, stop him. Call the K9. Get out of the car. I need to sell. You know you're just getting more charges, Hannah. No, I'm just saying. Uh, I just said, calm. Also, I'm pretty sure that one cop has fuzzy handcuffs. Either that or it's his keys. But it looks like he's got fuzzy handcuffs. Like, are we sure these aren't like the special kind that come to your guys' bachelorette parties? Because I just saw something fuzzy on his butt. You don't tell us what to do. She's stripping. I just. <laughs> no. Yeah. No. You are under arrest. I'm After a struggle, officers are finally able to remove the suspect from the vehicle. You're under your stomach. Under your stomach. Under your stomach. No. Put your hands behind your back. You got tough. See, come on, on scene. I don't know why this is so funny to me, but. There's no way. How are you going to get her up off the ground? She's total dead weight, and she definitely ain't going to help you if she wasn't going to step out of the car. What do you need? You're going to need two of them suckers. Okay. See, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, Hannah, we're going to roll you to your side, okay? No, no, sit me up now. We tried to sit you up. Okay. So roll no, towards no. me, okay? Yeah, I do. Okay, then we're going to sit you up. Stand me up. Stand me up now. All right, go. just relax. Who is this now? I mean, it looks pretty damn cold there, too. So here's the thing. When I was bigger... Like, I'm still big, but when I was bigger, I didn't get cold all the time. Now I find that I'm cold a lot. But she's still rocking her insulation, so she's all right. No jacket, all that. Hi. All right, ready? Get your feet underneath you. Are we going to get it? No, I need someone to pull me up in the front. You, here. No, pull me ready? in the front. From under your arms. Ready? ready? One. There we go. Oh. All right, we're going to walk back. Oh. back. All right. No. Hey, Fupa gang. We have caught the leader of the infamous Fupa gang. She's going to jail, boys. <laughs> Can you kick us? Because no. you're going in that spot. No, I want my purse. I want we'll, get that. we'll get that for you. So now like what that. do you do? Just like I said before, you're getting more charges. I'd rather not. I'd rather you just go and sit into the vehicle. No, I don't want to sit in the vehicle. I want to talk to you. So this one's supposed to be here. Hi. Oh, he's a big boy. <laughs> What's going on? DUI arrest. Uh, Ooh, you, you see that? She got a little excited when she saw the big boy. Her drunk, horny brain started going crazy for him. I'm wondering if he's got fuzzy handcuffs. No, I'm not in DUI oh, arrest. arrest. Oh, DUI arrest. Uh, okay, so there's a there's an arrest. Okay, so what else? Then we pull her out of the car. She was just getting out of the car. Okay. So Spit mask. Back Are you hurt? Are no. Nobody hurt? Are you hurt? No. No? Okay. And she says she will fight I mean, spitters are quitters, so you don't need a spit mask. I want to talk to my first before I go in there. You that. can do that once we get back to the So here, here's, the, here's, here's what our, pro, our protocol is. Uh, you got to go in back in the squad car. Okay? Then where are our options in? We're going to put you in a wrap. I want to have my phone. You can do that. You can do that at the police department. No, 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 I can't. Oh, no, I can't. I'll undo it now. That's not going to happen right now. Okay. You understand that we'll, we'll, we'll end up putting you in a wrap? I mean, the level of entitlement on this chick is kind of sickening. I don't know why people think that they could just tell 
people what they're going to do. Your ass is caught, lady. Like, that goose is cooked. You're done for. Just get your ass in the car. Yeah. Just okay, then, wait, one phone call right now. Do you see? Do you see where we're at right now? The Johnny Cock. We're, we're, we're all. Why am I being. Why, well, from why what I understand. I from what I understand. I know. I'm, you know? You know why you're arrested? I don't know why. Flashing because you're people. a DUI? Alright, just let me call. Make one phone call. One phone call right now? Yep. Okay. We'll make it happen. If it's going to keep you from. my phone. If it, it's going to keep you. Better call Saul. From fighting us? We'd rather do that. Okay, will you cooperate if we make this phone call? I know, you're a big boy. So can we do that then? Will you cooperate um, then with us? Yeah. Okay, all right, read the phone. <laughs> <laughs> she keeps calling him a big boy, and now she's just meat-gazing down, like just staring at their crotch. <sighs> Tana... Uh, just let them know that I am, um, <sighs> what the phone, God, yeah. Nope, you know what you Nope, not seeing well, you said, Well, you said we had a deal. I know, I'm not taking the deal. Nope, not going in there. Nope. What is this, deal or no deal? Like, you already signed up for that one. Just get in the damn car, lady. Can't they hobble her? Don't they have, like, a, what's it called, hog tie? Can't they hog tie her? I mean, I'm fat, but I hope they wouldn't hog tie me. No, just front me. Just give them a minute. Okay, open the door. Come on, Hannah. Don't fight. Come on. Oh, oh. Careful, What's careful, it? careful, careful. Don't get kicked in the face. Oh. She's growling. No! I mean, if you're going to sit there and act tough, owie probably is not the toughest thing you could say. Just shut the f*** out! Are you going to call? Don't kick. Oh my god, he has no idea how big it is. Don't kick us, Hannah. Wait, hold on, hold on. Ooh. See, this is what I figured my 600 pound arrest would look like, but if you're drunk, actually my grandma says if you're drunk you should be able to like plead temporary insanity, but that's her defense because she drank for so long. She hasn't drank in like 20 years though. <laughs> I work hard. I work right, hard. Sit, sit her down. I'll tell you what's strong. The elastic on them yoga pants. You are giving that sucker a workout. Wait. Less lethal. We're going to wrap you. Oh, Use the spike strip. Yeah, little thing is gonna help me. My tits are bigger than this thing. Okay, yeah. Okay, okay. Oh, sit down. Oh, sit down. Let's wrap one. There's a little wrap. Yeah. It's Come gonna on. go around my stomach. I'm pretty sure she is drastically, like, underestimating the strength of that thing. It looks like a damn toe strap through the middle of it. And also, she's about to hit the deck and break one of the officer's legs. Then she'll be in trouble for hurting an officer. Oh, this is the harness? But Damn. I got spinning, though. Oh, this is nice. Okay. Hey. A fat cocoon. Oh, And so you guys are supposed to lift me up. Yep. 
Okay. I think that, right. the hook is on there. Oh, that's pretty good. Then tight, then tight, then tight. What's tight? What's tight? What's tight? What's tight? What's tight? That's what's tight? what she said. Uh, no, I feel like like my wrists are tight. Okay. No, like now you guys can definitely like take me wherever you want to go. Okay. Right. Do you guys think it would be like cruel and unusual punishment if we just throw her on the roof like a Christmas tree? I mean, she is wearing green. Oh yeah, this is good. <laughs> oh, there's yeah. no way. There's no way. Ready? On three. Ready? Yeah. One, oh, two, oh. three. Oh, 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 no, my shoulder's out! Well, good luck. That's what happens when you put 400 pounds on a shoulder and we'll just stand up like a big girl. Take it out your hand. Take it off. No, no, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Oh my god! Here you see the suspect appear to have some sort of medical emergency. However, it is unclear if this was an act or real. What's going on, girl? Yeah. What's going on? Seek out. What's going on, girl? What's going on? Can it breathe? Hannah. I mean, it looks pretty suspect to me. I think you guys need to taser and make sure our heart's still going. Just look at me. Look at me. Yeah, put her on her side. Why are we bouncing her boot? Finger towards you, Nika. Take me to the side. She's on, she's on my knees. Okay, she's out on her knees. Here we go. You have a blanket right here. Oh, she wants to sit up with her. You want to sit up, Hannah? Yeah. Okay. We got a blanket for you, Hannah, okay? Oh, these are the I'm nicest so damn cops. Oops, didn't mean to click that. I mean, these are the nicest damn cops I think I've ever seen. Because they're giving her a blanket. They're going pretty easy. I've seen them go like 0 to 100 real quick. They're being pretty chill with her. No, I'm not towing it. No, don't tow the car. Is there anything else in your car other than your purse? Yep, all kinds of things. Okay, grab. Do you need the purse? Because you're no, not. Yep, don't tow it. Go ahead, Heidi. What else do you need inside the car? Tow it wide. Tow it wide. It's just going to cost me money. Right now, we got the paramedics coming to check you out. Let me get up. No, why am I sitting here? Okay, I know. I didn't pass she, out. She did not. Hey, no, Nika, she wants to stay and let her stand. Let me stand. help. Help me up. Help me up. Help me up. Lean against the car. Oh, buddy, you're about to lose your shoulder. You keep playing with that with one arm. No, no, let me get out by myself. Okay. So I guess there's nothing wrong with your shoulders then. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> no okay. way. Mm -hmm. Do you want a do you want a coat? No, I do. This is nice. Who gave me this? Thanks, okay. Guys are gonna evaluate you, okay? Because you act like you had a seizure, so therefore we can't take a chance. Okay, so that's why you're on the floor. We put you in that position that you're in, right? And we play it safe. We called them, but then miraculous. I don't know how that works, but I imagine if anything goes wrong with like health-wise, you have to call EMTs, and then they got to come there and deal with a drunk person who's acting like a big old baby. So you came out of the seizure like it was nothing. Okay. So now you're playing games with these guys. We called them out from the firehouse for you. So right now, you just wasted these guys' time? You don't need them? Is that what you're saying? I'm not getting arrested for do I? Okay, no. they're not here to arrest you. They're here to make sure you're okay medically. Yeah. I'm fine. I'm yeah? Good. Okay, then answer walk back home. No, no, you're not house. walking back home. How about you answer their questions so they can leave? That's fine. Just tell it. I'm just going to walk back. You're not walking. Why did she think that, like, the EMTs getting there was like a Uno reverse card? And she was going to get to just walk away from this thing. That's how you know drunk people are stupid. Back. Uh, then what? Why can't I walk back? Because you are under arrest. For what? For DUI. For DUI? Yeah, for DUI. You're under arrest. You're not going to your house. Mm -hmm. uh, no, I'm good. Right, you're good. I'm do you great. want? Do you want these guys? Do you need their help? No, nope, no. not So at is that all. a refusal? Okay. All right, all right. Okay. All right, see ya. Yeah. I put her back in handcuffs, you're, you're good. Yeah, bring her back for me. Yeah. How do I get the DUI? For, for drinking and driving. How? 
you're, you're one, I can smell the alcohol, and you're behind that car. You're behind the driver's seat. Wait, so now what? Now we've got to go to the police department and process you and give you an opportunity to bond out. Oh, yeah. Her goose is cooked. She's definitely spending at least the night. Probably. I mean, if it's the weekend, she might be in there till Monday. You can make whatever phone calls. I'm going to bond right now. Okay, that's, you don't bond here. We don't do it on the street. Come on, let's go. Yeah. I'm not bonding here. I'm not. Gonna... Okay, done. Okay, then we're going to wrap you. Oh, my gosh. What did I do? Again? Okay, this time, we're going to continue, and we're going to be careful when we pick her up. Yep. But we're going to use the blanket. No. Come on. There you go. Yes. You know who I just realized she reminds me of? Zangief from Street Fighter. Not... You guys hold on to that strap in her legs? Two hands? Yep. Right. Oh. You ready? No. One, two, three. Oh. Nikki, you want help over here? On the... On the... Ah. One help. On... Yeah, right here. We'll grab yep. part of the sheet. Grab part of the blanket. Yeah. Okay, ready? ready? One, two, three. That's kind of how I pictured this going. I was like, if I go dead weight, because she's probably 200 less than I was. So if they can't get four up, I think I could have got out of jail with this trick. Like, this was the friggin' deal or no deal. Like, if I just drop, I might have got off on it. I think she's got rabies. She's growling. Let me go now. Oh. Alright, we gotta put her seatbelt on. Yep. No, fuck my seatbelt! You didn't put a fucking seatbelt on me! You didn't put a fucking seatbelt on me! What's the problem with a seatbelt? You're already in BDSM gear at this point. Seatbelt? Are you kidding me? <laughs> okay. There are covers. She's tired. Take a nap, sweetie. It's okay. Get your drunk ass in jail. Hi. Have fun get me out of here now. I would love to take you out of that. Huh? Should I take you out of this? No, you're gonna you you fuckers are gonna carry me out of this like you put me in this. Oh, so, so you're not gonna let us? No, if you're you, gonna carry me out of like the just you, like I mean when you're caught, you're caught, lady. Like the jig is up. It's done. Your goose is cooked. Just get your ass in there, get it done with, and don't get the extra charges. That's what I don't understand. People that sit there and fight and fight and fight. When it's like, it's over. But it depends on how drunk she is, because she might just be stuck on stupid. And we're not going to carry you all to the cell. It's a far away. Oh, good luck. We're not going to do that. We're just gonna okay, well, I'm going to sleep right here. We're going to take you out of the car and take you out of this. Are you going to cooperate with us? Nope. Okay, she's insisted she's not cooperating. Going straight to county. We're going to do uh, food the rest. In the end, Hannah was taken straight to county jail because she refused to be taken out of her harness peacefully. Would you look at that? That's a lady who done goofed big time. But also, she kind of made it last longer than most people do. These cops deserve a little bit of praise because they should have just made her ride the lightning a long time ago. And she gets an F. Like I said earlier, a combination of stubbornness and entitlement allowed Hannah to believe that she had options that she simply did not have. True. If Hannah had just accepted the reality of her situation and cut her losses, she might have had a good chance at fighting this in court. I As mean, that's also true. If you, uh, if the cops are questioning you or something, you don't even remember what you had for breakfast. Just shut your mouth. That's what lawyers are for. To the Crystal Lake Police Department, I give them a B. I think there are a few lessons to be learned 
and strategies that can be adopted to better handle the issue of transporting large people. Yeah, definitely. Perhaps strapping her into an ambulance stretcher and placing her into the back of the ambulance for transport would have been a better option. Lastly, a special shout out to Sergeant Singer for making I every- I didn't even think of that. Actually, they had the EMTs there. That would have been so easy. But this chick decided she wanted to be wrapped up like a burrito. The attempt to de-escalate and calmly find a peaceful solution. Let's just hope that if any of us have an issue with the law, that there's an officer like Sergeant Sanders there to keep things cool. Good guy. Now with all, all that right. said, well, there's body cam realities uh, news. I think it's Lass's news. That's his channel. I love this. I love cop cams. I think they're freaking hilarious because it never ceases to amaze me the stupid stuff people do when they're drunk. So, uh, yeah, go subscribe to his channel if you like this because I think he does a lot of stuff like this. I just found this the other day. But all right, like, comment, subscribe. I'll see y'all later. Peace.